We're getting closer to it. Like right here. What? Shit. Oh what? shit. Ah. What the fuck? D, I, I found some sort of supply bag, light camping gear, some clothes, and basics, but it was alarmed. I think that's what was making the receiver go haywire. You're okay? It's not a trap or anything? Yeah, I'm I hope fine, not. But there's there's also a set of keys here. I don't know why they'd be hidden out here. They say Shoshone National Forest, Cave 452. Is that the one in the canyon? Yeah, it is. <sighs> Who the hell took them? And what the hell is in that cave? Okay, okay, let's just think. <laughs> Says the woman with a half a bottle of tequila in her belly. Exactly. Maybe they're panicking and we're preparing to beat it. The fire has them spooked and we have new walkie-talkies, so we have the upper hand. Yeah, well, it's hard to feel like you have the upper hand when you're standing in the dark in the middle of the woods. Oh. Well, you're back in your tower. Maybe you need a drink, too. I'm not in my tower. I am looking at a man standing in your lookout. What? And it's not you. It no, is not me. Oh my god, go. I'm going. What the hell is in my lookout tower? Hello? Someone up here? I don't see anyone up here. She was just there. Son of a bitch. Set player taped to my damn door. Uh, I don't even know what to say to that. <laughs> well, let's see what's on it. Oh my god. They're trying to blackmail us. It's a tape of us talking down at the site. It sounds like it was recorded from somewhere nearby. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, and it sounds like we were the ones who burned it down. Exactly! It sounds like blackmail! Idea. No. We are screwed. No! D, just don't freak out, okay? Don't freak out. Oh my god, what the fuck is happening? Henry! Oh my god. <laughs> this has just gotten insane. Meadow fire. Um, 
So, I just got off the horn with that lookout who's wondering what I know, or that I'm an arsonist, or that I'm fucking losing it. Furthermore, I bet you don't have the only tape of us from last night, so someone has evidence to back it up. We need to find out what someone's been keeping in that cave. I'm going down there now. We don't have a lot of time left out here, and if we don't find some fucking answers, when they lift us out of here, it's gonna be in handcuffs. Don't worry, Doyle. I'll, I'll get to the bottom of this. It's fine. What was I going back to anyway? Henry, ah! you're going back to whatever you choose. Come on, this is serious. I am serious. Look, we just tell the truth and the chips will land where they land. Let's go. Yeah, I suppose you're right. I know. We'll get through this. But look at all the smoke. The fire's getting bigger and closer. The wind has definitely picked up. Alright, let's check our map and make sure we're going the right direction here. Cave 452. Alright, we need to go north. Let me check my map one more time quick. Yeah, here we go. Let's go this way. There's a trail that leads this down there this way. Yeah, here we go. Our, our very familiar drop-offs. Crazy drop-offs. Ten feet or better. I'm, I'm still in awe that Henry is, is able to do this without hurt himself. There's no way I would drop off 10 feet without some sort of a, a rope of some sort. I know me, I'd end up rolling an ankle or something. Let's see. I wonder what's down here. What do you guys, what do you guys think is down here in, in this cave? Trying to pit us against each other. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. That's not gonna happen, though. Thanks, Henry. Here we go, guys. What's in the cave? Locked. Delilah, someone locked me in the cave. Shit. Is this thing working? Delilah, send someone to the cave, please. Can't get any damn reception. Hold on. Hold on before I do anything. Jesus, this is a big cave. I can't, can't go down. Okay, I just wanted to see if I could go down there and explore. But I can't. What is going on down here? It's freezing in here. Very echoey as well. Is anybody down there? 
shoe. ourselves up just just perfectly what is going on guys this is like right into the fire it looks like That is a hell of a drop. Hey, hey, are you there? Yeah, what is it? What did you find? Nothing yet, because someone tried to trap me in there. You saw someone? No, someone slammed the gate behind me and then ran away. I found another way out, but if I hadn't, Jesus! So you, so you didn't find anything? No, th there's a spot where someone had sunk an anchor, but the hardware's gone now. <sighs> I don't have any climbing equipment. I just have my ropes. I'm gonna hike back to Two Forks and see if I can find anything that could double as an anchor to use in the spot. Well, that doesn't sound dangerous. Wow. What the? Delilah, I just found an outcropping that someone was using as a little fort. I think it was Brian Goodwin. Really? Yeah, he built himself a real castle. He was in the middle of really sprucing up the joint when they left. of rocks stacked up. He made a wall and a perimeter. Oh, God. Yeah, that's, that's perfect. You know, maybe he made it because he was afraid of them. Uh, whenever I think of Brian possibly going through this crap, I get... I get sick to my stomach. Yeah. Uh, sorry. Science fair. Well, that's quite a quite a schematic that he, that he drew up. I'm gonna hold on to that. You're dead. What the fuck? It's kind of dark. Just a little bit dark, to be honest with you. Let's hold on to that. Who knows? Maybe it'll come in handy. to get out of here. Keep coming back to this place.
I met this kid's got an imagination. Battle axes, long swords, throwing daggers, short sword. Brian, age 29. Wasn't Brian a kid? Or am I mis mixing this up? Ham radio design. Brian and Ned. It could have sworn Brian was a kid and his and his dad was Ned. It could be wrong. Hmm. Explore deeper into the cave. My name is Brian Goodwin. If, found, if, if you found this note, it should be a bunch of climbing anchors, I hope. Could you do me a favor and return them to me? Brian Goodwin is my is my name, is my, is my mail. My address is 55 Fox Street Lane, North Platte, Nebraska. If you tell me your name and address, I will give you a reward for this. You're probably wondering why I left these here. Well, they are my dad's and I don't want him to lose them but I don't want them anymore climbing on this trip so I I thought I would pretend to lose them but if you help me get them back everyone will be happy thank you very much for your time PS the reward will be good and I don't, I don't know that's this is starting to sound weird to me Lander Wyoming what does it say I'm with my dad in Lander, Wyoming. It's pretty neat. Dad, what does that say? Something in a spot called Sinks Canyon, or Sunks Canyon. Most of Wyoming looks like home in Nebraska, but there are mountains and woods where you go far. I'm sorry I can't mow my lawn, or your lawn, this, this summer, but I hope you found a good person to do it instead. Can you write back and tell my dad when school starts, because I don't think he knows. Your friend and neighbor, Brian Goodwin. So I've been looking around this area for quite some time. I actually gave up for a minute. I just, I wasn't sure where to go. Then I noticed this rock, and finally, I figured out how to get down. I literally been walking around this this area for ten minutes before I found this, this stupid thing. That's why I had to edit this, this segment down just a little bit. I have to repel down. Let's see. Let's see if we can get down here. We want to uh, explore the cave a little bit more. What do you think is in there? I have no idea, girl. There's got to be something. Why else try to kill me? I don't know, really. I mean, we got to find out. What do you think? Whatever it is, they don't want you telling anyone about. I mean, they closed the door when they could have just bashed your head in with a rock or chopped you up with a... Are you serious with this shit right now? Holy shit. Uh, She's getting dark. God, are you sure you want to go back in there? Yeah, especially now that I'm thinking about all the fun ways to be killed. I'm sorry. Look, at least whoever locked you in doesn't know you've gotten out. Hopefully you find whatever they're hiding in there and it'll be worth the risk. Man, Delilah, she got awfully dark there. But yeah, oh, uh, also, those girls turned up. Looks oh, like thank God. Them. Nobody did. They took some farmer's tractor for a joyride down in Riverton and uh, landed in jail. <sighs> Dodged a bullet there. Yeah, we've got enough unanswered shit to answer for, I'd say. I would say so. I thought for sure those two girls had been killed by a bear. The way their, their tent had been shredded up. It actually looks like it's this way. Ok, 
Do we get in through here? I'm glad, I'm glad we still have the key at least. How can I go down? It's not really what I wanted to do. I wanted to go down. But there's no tie off spot. Oh, here we go. Roots coming in. We saw a shoot earlier. A red shoe, if, if I remember correctly. <laughs> this cave seems really short to me. Oh, a drop off. Oh, I sure hope we can get out of here. Oh, shit. Man, uh, this was not the... That was not what I was expecting to find down here. Climb out and report body, okay. I didn't expect Brian to be down here, I guess. I guess that's, that was what was surprising. It doesn't surprise me that I found a body. Just, I didn't have it in my mind that it was going to be his. Report this guy's body, and we still have so many unanswered questions, though. And what the hell's what the hell's going on with that with that uh, with that radio station or uh, what is it called? The monitoring station. Excuse me. The monitoring station back there. Okay, drop down. What's that all about? Now we know what happened to Brian. It's just. One of many mysteries in this game. <sighs> wow, it's a bright up here. Hey, D. Hey, you, um, might want to take a seat. I've been sitting this entire time. I'm almost always sitting. What's... what's wrong? The only thing in the cave was a body. A body? God, what a mess. Delilah. 
It's Brian Goodwin. <sighs> Gotta be fucking kidding me. How does that... <clears throat> what? I don't... <sighs> How? Climbing, I think, or made to look like a climbing accident. I, I think that's just what it was. I mean, he was probably exploring the cave and, and maybe his rope gave out. But whoever locked me in there probably didn't even know about him. What do we do now, D? I I mean, are you okay? No, I'm not. He'd be alive if I had told someone he was out here. It's interesting that they gave the option me. that Ned was responsible. His dad. At the bottom of that cave. It's not, that's I, not gonna. There's, Ned's there's, not gonna be out here trying to say. kill us, is he? Hike back. I think we're leaving tomorrow anyway. Day seventy-nine. His dad's not out here, is he? I don't know. I just got this weird feeling. 